already filled in my brows using Freedom's Brow Pomade and now I'm just tidying it up using LA Girls Pro Concealer in the shade Warm Honey. So I'm starting off with the face makeup this time and as usual I'm reaching for the Benefit Professional Primer and just applying that in my T-zone. And now I'm just going to colour correct on the areas where I have discoloration which is mainly around the sides of my mouth and just blending it out using the round part of the Beauty Blender. I've decided to go for the Giorgio Armani foundation which is my favourite high-end dewy light coverage foundation and as usual just buffing it into my skin using the Kabuki brush. And because I am going for a full coverage look I did apply two pumps of the foundation. Moving on to concealer I'm using my favourite, my favourite, favourite, all time favourite concealer, the NARS Creamy Matte Concealer. And oh my god, I'm just obsessed with this concealer. Like I've never tried any concealer where I've had very little creasing under the eyes until I discovered this beauty. Okay, so now moving on to contouring, my favourite part. Um, I'm just contouring uh, the usual areas using taking the darker shade from the palette. Um, yeah, I'm just using a small flat foundation brush as well to apply for that. And then using a angled fluffy brush to blend it all in um, to get rid of all the harsh lines and all make it look very natural as possible. And obviously not to forget my double chin. And then to blend out the nose contour I'm just using a concealer brush. Okay, once I'm done blending the contour, I'm just uh, using a damp beauty blender to blend out the concealer. I'm blending it uh, to my eyelids as well to act as an eye primer so I won't need to apply any eyeshadow primer when I move on to the eye makeup. So yeah, just gently pressing it in. And then to set it all in place, I'm using my Ben Nye Banana Powder and then again blending it up to my eyelids as well so that, it's, so, that, so that it's all set and ready before I apply my eyeshadow. And then to add more definition to my face after all that concealing and powdering, I'm just going to bronze my face using the sleek uh, blush and contour palette. So I'm using my favourite, obviously, a modern renaissance palette and as usual taking raw sienna as my um, what do you call it transition shade yeah and just blending that into my crease now i'm taking red okra and just applying that onto my eyelids using a flat brush um, so basically i'm trying to go for a warm tone smoky eye so now i'm taking rogar and just applying that into my crease using a fluffy brush um, and just adding more product until I'm happy with the colour. And then I'm taking a plain fluffy brush just to blend it all in uh, to get rid of any harsh lines. And then I'm taking Love Letter which is a nice pretty pink shade and just applying that on my lower lash line. And then finally I'm taking Primavera and just applying that in my um, inner inner corners yeah to brighten the inner corners and then as usual I'm going for the wing eyeliner uh, and using a bourgeois liquid liner to draw the wing liner So before applying the falsies, I'm just going to coat my lashes with uh, Maybelline's Lash Sensational Mascara. And for lashes, today I went for Samantha Lashes by Huda Beauty. And then for the highlight, I'm going to be using Laura Geller's Illuminator 
in the shade Gilded Honey. I don't know if I'm pronouncing it right. Let me know if I'm pronouncing Laura Geller wrong. I don't know. But yeah, I'm just playing that in the usual areas. So just to sharpen or tidy up the contour, I'm just going back in with the Ben Nye Banana Powder and just applying that under the area where I apply the contour under the cheekbone and just sweeping it off straight away. And for the lips, you know it, you know it. <laughs> I'm using the usual Urban Cafe Lip Liner by NYX. Sorry, NYX. Oh, I'm so sorry. <laughs> and then um, applying lip gloss. This has to be my favourite nude lip gloss. It's called Weho by Colourpop. And then to set my face, I'm using Slay All Day by Gerard Cosmetics. And yeah, basically I've just straightened my hair and dressed into something a little more sassy. And yeah, finished look. I hope you guys enjoyed watching this quick transformation video. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you all in my next video. Bye guys.